Yo, what is up? I'm Faded Tax, and I'm bringing you some brand new Pokemon Vault White Randomized Monolock Challenge. In the last episode, you guys went ahead and made his way up into Driftful City. We went exploring around in the town area. Um, we battled a few trainers near the cold storage area, and then we made his way up onto Route 6. And uh, we battled a few trainers up here, and we went around and searched for a water type Pokemon, but no one was to be seen. And hopefully in today's episode we're going to be covering the um, uh, route just uh, just, uh, just up here and then um, we're going to be covering the cold storage hopefully in one episode today. So um, I want to get straight into today's episode. If you could go ahead and drop a like it would be greatly appreciated. Also if you're brand new to the channel and you want to stick around for some more content, do not hesitate to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. This is just the start. I mean it's episode what like 20... Two, I want to say, or 21, or one of the two. I don't know, I can't really remember. It's a bolt recording so I think it's 22. But um, yeah. Episode, no, it's 21 in fact, 21, there we go, it's episode 21, um, we've still got a lot of stuff to cover, um, plus the legendary catcher-in after we've completed the game as well, so um, I will hope you guys stick around till the end, hopefully you will, um, but anyways, yeah, like I said, let's get straight into today's episode, so hopefully, hopefully, today's episode, we're going to be managed to capture a, a water type, yes, that's amazing, I thought, we, we looked around last episode and we couldn't find one water Pokemon, <laughs> not even bad. We captured the guy on the first ball as well. Not even bad. Alright, so a few of you guys left some nickname suggestions in the last episode. Let me just quickly pull it up here. And uh, let's just choose off some nicknames. Alright, let me just quickly find him up when the page decides to load. Ah, three years later. What? Why is it showing no comments? And like a bunch of you guys left comments. Alright, there we go. Um, you should call the next female Sheena. I could do, but um, this Pokemon doesn't like represent that gold feeling like I forgot for Sheena. Um, who you can next? You can name the next one like Pest Pestilence Pestilence. I guess that sounds pretty cool. You know what? Fuck it, Pestilence sounds pretty badass. Alright, so let's call this guy Pestilence. Alright, let me make sure I spell this thing right. Pest. I L. E N C E. Pestilence. I hope that's how you pronounce that name, Pestilence. I hope to God it is. All right, so we pick up Pestilence, the um, frillish. Let's have a look at this thing. All right, it's got na naive, na naive nature. There we go. It's got the cursed body, may disable a poke a move used on the Pokemon. It's got seismic toss, hydro cannon, clamp, and water pulse, which is not too bad, I guess. Um, what I want to do first thing though is just quickly turn on the EXP share, which I'm pretty sure I got. Oh, it's not like X and Y, is it? Oh my god, I forgot. I bet it's gonna be up in my bag somewhere. I did get this thing quite early in the game. So I'm going to give that to Pestilence so this guy can get some EXP while we train up. Um, we've got a trainer to take on up here. Alright, we're totally in sync using our amazing connection. We'll teach you all about Rangers. Alright, I guess so, dude. I guess so. Magnazone, holy shit. Um, I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to go into Rue because Rue can tank it a lot more than um, Titan can. It goes to the Electro Web. Alright, slow on my speed, but I'm pro Oh my days! Thank you, Crab Hammer. Whew, this ain't looking good. This is not looking good. Thank God we managed to hold on with Ro then. Alright, let's get back up to full HP. That was it happened to be a crit, didn't it? It just had to be a crit. Why is Electro so powerful, man? This is not working out. Why is Crab Hammer missing? Scold this thing. Thank you. My dears. And a magic. I'm pretty sure Pestilence should be able to take this magic app out. Unless it's got like fucking Horn Leech or some shit like that. Aqua Tail. Ain't gonna do shit. One more size it toss. Alright, nice. KO that magic app off. Got some nice and <laughs> EXP from that magic app. Holy shit. Do you know much about this berry? A cherry berry? I'm pretty sure I do. Pretty sure I do. Um, I need to heal up actually. 
All right, get the high potion to you, get the high potion to you, and a, um, a quick super potion to Pestilence. Get the team looking all buff, so that's all nice. All right, let's go into this girl. Pouring rain, fighting Pokemon. All right, sounds cool. She's got a Mushrana. All right, this may be annoying. Um, I want to take this thing down as fast as I can. So the Bubble Beam almost is enough to kill the thing off, goes for the Lust Purge. We can tank that up, and two Bubble Beams, and that is bye-bye to that thing. A Cacnea. Now I've got Icy Wind, haven't I? So I should be able to take you out. Alright, awesome, that Cacne is gone. An Ordino. This is going to give some sick EXP. Oh my god, wow, really? Rue wants to learn Hydro Cannon, my days. Do I really want to do the... He's got a... Nah. I can't do it. I can't take that chance of um, missing on the next one. I really can't. So we won't learn that. We won't learn that. We'll keep continuing on this route though. I'm pretty sure there's a lot to do on this. There's quite a lot of trainers as well. Alright, Trubbish, I'm going to take you out quite fast, dude. I'm going to go for the Bubble Beam. Easy enough. A Vibrava. Again, I can spam the hell out of Bubble Beam. Since it is Terrakion, holy shit. Alright, let me heal up Titan. Fiery Dance, really. I did two damage. I feel sorry for that guy. Alright, Terrakion, goodbye. I don't think there was any chance of survival then, at all. Alright, I think this is a place where... Um, they talk about the different types of those... Um, thingy Pokemon? Dealing, yeah, that's it. I, I was trying to think of the name, then it was Dealing. Alright, so I, got, I finally got there. Right, there's an item to pick up in this grass here. It's an Alexa, which is pretty nifty. Alright, I think I really need to get Frillish up. I don't know what level that guy evolves. I'm pretty sure he does evolve, but um, I don't know what level it is. We'll just have to keep training the guy up, and hopefully he will soon evolve. I know those things can be an absolute pain to deal with, so it's good that I've got one on my team. This thing's got Grass Pledge. But another Bubble Beam should see this no poison, thank you. A bubble Beam to say goodbye. Pestilence is level 32 and wants to learn Razor Shell, no thank you. Why did I get over Seismic Toss then? I dushed. That's because I'm rushing, I was, I was just like super speeding. Alright, no biggie. Alright, level 47, sweet. And a Kakuna, see, I could have gone into Pestilence there. I'm going for the Seismic Toss. Alright, let's Water Pulse this thing. Oh my god, nearly KO'd it off. I happened to get poisoned, didn't I? I just had to. So no worries, I've got the um, antidotes and shit, so it's a good job I actually stocked up on some items. Alright, um, whereabouts are you, Antidote? Alright, there we go, all nice. All nicely healed up. Oh my god, it's a fungus. But yeah, like I said, there's a plenty there's a plenty enough trainers to take on, on this route here. So it's really nice um, to get some EXP up. This guy's got a frillish. Watch it have water absorb. So I'm not going to take that chance. I'm going to go for the rock tomb. Alright, goodbye to you. And you got a ghastly. Alright, let me bubble beam this thing real quick. And a duot, I can go again with the rock soon. I know it's not doing really enough a lot, but I don't think there's this... Thing. Fat screw it, I'll go for the bubble beam. See, why does bubble beam do to play more damage? I find it ridiculous how that can happen. Alright, Titan, get back to full HP. You're gonna be a fungus. No, you're not. Leaf stones. You're gonna be a fungus. Yeah, I knew it. You just had to be a fungus just chilling there, didn't you? Alright, I will show you the energy I've become by being here. I guess if that's what you want to do, bro. Viper. Okay, let's go. Bubble Beam easily destroy that thing. I'm loving this guy. I'm not loving you. Horn Leech, that's why. If only I would have gone for the Bubble Beam first, I would have been able to take that thing down. 
Alright, Rue, let's take this guy away with an icy wind. Goodbye. And Excalibur, I'm pretty sure you're a bug, aren't you? No, you're bugging steel, maybe? Megahorn? Crap hammer? Alright, sweet. I was I was in two minds and what, what to do. I could have gone for the hyper potion or I could have gone and healed urn like gone for the crab hammer, so I just took the risk. And it paid off, so that's nice. Alright, all the team back up to full HP. What's this guy all about here, chilling? Oh, I bet he's not gonna let us pass, is he? Okay, you are. Now what should I do? The entrance to Charge Stone Cave is just as he blocked off. Okay. Oh dear, you Pokemon somehow don't seem well. You can rest. Yes, thank you. That's what I needed. And we get some Dusk Stones as well. That's amazing. Here on Route 6 is a place called Mr. Alton Cave. Supposedly deep in that cave you can find an amazing Pokemon called Calabian. Or said to protect Pokemon from sea or fire in ancient Unova. Sounds pretty scary. But yeah, that's where the um, cave is blocked off, so we can't do anything there. So I guess the only option really is to go back into the town and go to the cold storage area where we can take on Team Plasma. They've been hiding away in there. I really wanted to fit it all into one episode, so I'm going to try my best. I'm going to try my best to take on the cold storage in this episode, but um, I don't think there may be an item. Nope. Wow, really? Oh, a double battle. I totally forgot about these things. Alright, can I get out of the grass without... Yes, thank you. But the real, real question is, can I get through this without running? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Right, sweet. Let me just quickly run past all these people. I'm pretty sure there's a shortcut I can take here. Yeah, that'll just take us back all the way down here. And then we're back in Mistral Drif Drifle, say. What the hell? Right, let's get healed up. In fact, no, we just healed up, didn't we? We just healed up. Alright, so the cold storage is the place where we need to head to next. Um, this is where Team Plasma has been hiding. And um, we can also capture new Pokemon on this route as well. So that's pretty decent. If the water Pokemon wants to appear, that, that is. So the first Pokemon to appear is the Torcoil. I'm hoping that we can run into a water type. I really am. A Burmate. I really could do with like um, a... I don't know, like a Vaporeon. I really want a Vaporeon. But no, in my look... It ain't gonna happen, is it? Alright, Razor Fangs. Aquilava. If only it was a fire type monolock. That'd be awesome. Alright, there's this guy just chilling on himself. He's got four Pokemon with a Hypno to lead off with, so that's quite powerful. Let me scold this guy real quick. A Pulse of Burn. Alright, maybe a Scold. Yep, yeah. alright, sweet. Ferro Seed, I really could do with like an ice type move on um, a Titan. I really could. Just for the fact that he can handle um, grass types a lot better. If I would have had Titan, if I would have had Triton, he would have been able to go for Lava Plume. And that would have been absolutely insane. Alright, first things first, he's Vanillish. Easily gets destroyed with a Rock Tomb. And a Machoke to finish off. Let me go Bubble Beam real quick. Can we use enough? Is it enough? Yeah, sweet. Alright, awesome. Um, is there actually anything really to pick up? There's just an item over here. And some Dawn Stunts. I thought it was going to be a Fungus there for some strange reason. Alright, let's re-attempt. Relicanth. No one of the best water types in my opinion at all, but... He's a water type, so we need, we need to capture him. Hydro fucking cannon, holy shit. Right, let me water pulse. Oh my god, with this sturdy, that's awesome. Right, Cherish Ball. Ah, oh, sweet. Alright, sweet. So we pick off um, the uh, Relicanth. It's not one of the best things I've wanted to catch, really. But I guess screw it. It's a water type, so... Um... Alright, Musha. Alright, there we go, Musha. Musha the Relicant. Really? That's funny. Alright, so we got two new team members. Cool, that we Hydro Pump turned down. So, two new team members. So, that's pretty awesome, actually. Um, now. Now. 
we can get some grinding done. We can get these guys trained up to look nice and buff. And then they should be good to take on the gym leader. They can help us out as well, so that'll be decent. I just need a little bit of training up on them, I guess. So quickly go into Pestilence. Right, you want to know about this place? It's called Storage. Inside there are workers with their Pokemon. Really? Oh, what? Asuna, do you think Team Plasma could be in there? I don't like cold places. We have to check. What a bother. Is there an item just chilling around here? There's got to be. A Lipard. That's awesome. Alright, there is an item in a heart scale. Alright, so that's decent. Alright, awesome. So we're in the cold storage now. This is where Team Plasma's been hiding away. Well, still, is there anything more important than strength for trainers, like the champions said? I guess so, dude. Alright, no one to battle up there. Well, on there, should I say? Metal coats? Really? What the hell? I guess there is this guy, though. When he's cold, we wear a lot of clothes. Makes sense. Shit, this guy's got a Garbodor. Alright, Rue coming out. And it goes into the Grudon. Oh my days. Let's go Scald. Almost enough. He goes for the Earth Power. Um, one more Scald just to see off this Grudon. Thank you very much. And a Garbodor again. Alright, crab hammer this thing. Ah, I wanted to KO it off in one, but unfortunately it wasn't to happen. And a Hootoot. Why couldn't I use Icy Wind? There we go. Thank you. Sorry about that, dude. You got absolutely shrecked. Can I go down here? Alright, awesome. Alright, I'm in the cold storage. My heart is burning. My heart is burning. Wait, shiny fire on the dance floor. Oh, whoa, whoa. Alright, water pulse. Alright, sweet. It's confused. Can he hurt himself? He missed. That's nice. That's right, not going to do anything. But What? How? That's stupid. Alright, thank you. Goodbye, Firo. And get me up to level 36. Alright, that's awesome. An Ursaring. Razor Shell. <laughs> we pick him up and then he goes. <sighs> Fuck. Why didn't I swap? I didn't see that thunder coming at all. Did not see that thunder coming at all. Did not see it coming at all. That is fucking ridiculous. <sighs> That's me pissed. Alright, let's get a good dragon air. Rue just. Goodbye. Icy wind. Clump pearl, crab hammer. That's really made me pissed off, that. That has really pissed me off. I just can't believe I really needed to keep his. I need to keep Frillish. He could have been a good team member. He could have been a serious good team member. Alright, this guy's gonna be one. One team, uh, I know the episode's gonna be running a little longer than usual. Because I wanted to take on the cold storage. I did promise you guys that. So, um, a longer episode it is. Pylos Wine, eat this scald. There we go, all done. Alright, an item to pick up, a hype potion. Wrong time, wrong time. Oh, is there someone in there? Well, shall we go then? Yes, we should. All these guys just huddling up, it's like, what? All of you huddle around me, I can't take this cold. What the fuck's this? I can't believe you guys were really hiding, it's a bother if you were cold. Shall I show you outside? Pokemon are a king's friends. We're taking care of them. We can't let any harm come to them. Everyone drive those intruders away. Understood. Alright, so we got a bunch of trainers to take on here. Um, it's going to take quite a while, actually. Unless they've got, like, two Pokemon apiece, and I guess it won't be this long. It's going to raise my special attack, though, for the crap hammer. Alright, that's awesome. And a snow runt. I guess a scold. Yeah, easily done. Alright, that's awesome. Alright, I think we've only got two more people to take on. This guy's got a rock and roller. 
sturdy, I bet. No. Oh, that's that's shocking. Oh, we got this guy to take on, so we've got two more people to take on now. I guess it isn't really too much of a trouble. I mean, these guys haven't got the strongest Pokemon in the world so far. So it's really just a quick, easily taking these guys down. And the one last guy to take on on the end there. He's only got two Pokemon. He's got a Source Book, which I can go for the Icy Wind. Don't know why I went for the Grab Hammer. And that's just let me put him to sleep. That's just let him put me to sleep, should I say. Good job I've got an Awakening. Alright. Icy Wind. Ah, I should have gone for the Icy Wind straight up. Alarion, you can take that Crab Hammer, can't you? Goodbye. 55 Ru, what the hell? Turn down, please. Alright, so after defeating all these people, Claire just randomly turns up just out of the blue. Well, I'll be hiding in a chilly old place like this. You guys take those Pokemon robbers. Roger. Now, as if all these guys just go at their own will. It's like, what? Alright, so see you later to all you guys. Alright, you guys ain't so bad. Yep, I promise is a promise. Come and challenge me in my gym. Alright, whatever, Team Plasma's ideal, separating people and Pokemon, exactly the same as not having Pokemon in this world at all. A bunch of waste of oxygen. As soon as it's getting cold, I'm getting out of here. Alright, good luck with that. Um, there is an item here. Never melt ice. Wow. Alright, let me quickly get out of here, because I need to wrap up today's episode. It's running like 21 minutes, but we did manage to uh, do the cold storage scene as well, so I'm quite happy about that. We did cover a lot in today's episode, so I guess that's great. Um, unfortunately, we do have to deposit Frillish into the PC box, which I'm not too happy about. <sighs> Six deaths. Not a good thing. Not a good thing. Alright, let's heal back up, and I think we should be going. I'm going to stock up on some items before we take on the gym, uh, but I'll do that at the start of next episode. So we're going to go ahead and wrap it off for you guys. If you have enjoyed, be sure to go ahead and leave a like, because it's greatly appreciated. Also, if you're brand new to the channel and you want to stick around for some more content, or you enjoyed today's episode, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. For me, I've been Fenita Hugh, the viewer, have been amazing. Thank you so much, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.